Senior IT manager. I arrived in Germany, Sky Deutschland in Germany. Okay. And my employer right now is SAP. Mm -hmm. So I have massive racial comments, deleting emails, deleting all my information. I told you this before. Too dangerous to go back to work. The problem I have is numerous ones. Because I was originally in Würzburg when I got here. Mm -hmm. I talked to Norbert Hoffman, who started prescribing me Zopacon. Because I was under massive amounts of stress. Mm. I'm like, okay, the Zopacone got more and more until, I'll be honest, he was prescribing a lot. Mm. That, that, this guy is in Bayern. In Würzburg, Bayern. In Würzburg. So, as my um, case with SAP gets worse, mm -hmm. when I arrived and I saw you, my lawyer is in Hanover, mm -hmm. right? I had death threats. I had all my ties, my clothes stolen, my shit. I earned a lot of money and I'm dressed like this. Yeah. Massive insomnia. In a hotel, hostel, constant stealing. My lawyer's like, you need to stay in Hanover. So I took a break in Dottingham. I took one of the prescriptions this guy gave me because he went on vacation. Mm -hmm. The apothecary is like, this is ridiculous. What's going on? Refused the medication. Mm -hmm. um, I staggered over here. They actually uh, had to show my ID, my SAP laptop. I'm like, this is for a prescription. Mm -hmm. So what's happening since the last time I saw you is you gave me some Zopacone to give me some sleep. I was ex I looked exhausted, right? Mm -hmm. So since I've been here, no one's attacked me or anything, but my lawyer has disengaged because he's like, you're not living in Hanover. Mm -hmm. My email has now been blocked. Mm -hmm. I've had money stolen. I came, so you gave me that name to go to the doctor, but you said you need a doctor. That money that I mean, right. Crazy. So what I did, two things. I, I went to your doctor and they're like, oh, he's on holiday for three weeks. And I was like, well, why was I told to come here? Mm. They're like, I don't know. No, no, that was spontaneous. I mean, it was not planned that he's, he's going on a vacation. It right. spontaneous. But the problem is, I'm going from emergency to emergency. I contacted my doctor in mm. Würzburg. When he is prescri prescribing me, he's been doing it for one year, and I know what the drug is, right? And last time I saw him, I said, Doctor, I shouldn't even be on this crap. Mm -hmm. But I am under horrific harassment to the point I'm bordering on going to the consulate. Mm -hmm. Because it's getting to the point I don't feel safe. And the, pro the problem is, he's now been on vacation for five weeks. How, how do you call him if feel safe? I don't understand that. Well, is it normal for you to have your bank card? Well, let's put it this way. My legal case is against SAP, right? When I went on vacation to Italy and Croatia, which I told you last time, and I arrived in Munich, when you join one of these big corporations like Bank of America, Royal Bank of Canada, or SAP, they want you to open a specific bank account, right? Mm -hmm. As my story is now horrific with SAP, I've been to Waldorf and I told them the whole story. My wallet is on a Deutsche Bank. Mm -hmm. It has money in it, it has Sparkasa cards in it, it has everything. Guess what gets stolen? My commerce bank credit card and bank card. Guess what's associated to my legal case against SAP? Mm -hmm. My commerce bank. How many times have they been stolen? I've lost count. Mm -hmm. How many times am I close? And then mm -hmm. my email gets blocked, so now oh, I'm supposed to go to court on November 7th in Munich. Mm -hmm. Two days ago, what gets blocked? My email, with all my legal mm -hmm. documents, mm -hmm. my lawyer disengages. This doctor has been prescribing me Zopacone for a year. I can't mm -hmm. find him. I'm running all over the place to try and find you because you're the only one who treated me any decency. Mm -hmm. So you gave me that Zopacone, which was uh, on a Saturday. No, it was two days ago, yeah. Yeah. So I'm like, actually, I, you know what? That night, because I spoke to you and you treated me like a human being, I'm like, I feel a bit calmer. Mm -hmm. I got some sleep on Saturday, mm -hmm. Sunday. Mm -hmm. Because of what happened on Monday and Tuesday, again with, I couldn't find you, I couldn't find the other doctor, God knows where my doctor is, 
Mm. I'm not suddenly stressed out my mind again, mm. diarrhea, bump, and it's non-stop. Mm. And it's getting to the point of, I am going, going to collapse. Mm. Mm. I'm not Superman, and then I'm coming back to you for more help with sleep. I actually went to the, because I can't, I, my German is very limited, right? Mm. If you call this guy's answer machine, I, it's, an, it's, 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 it's not even a drug I should be on, but I've been on it for a year, so I obviously have a sleeping issue, right? Mm. He just disappears for five weeks, and I can't, I don't know where, that's mm. the third time he's done that. Mm. So you prescribe someone all this, mm. and then just disappear. But you know the top of one's actually not good? I, I'm well aware of that. I'm actually a very strong, healthy guy. The problem is, this. I started to see Dr. Hoffman. Who's Dr. Hoffman? I was Dr. Hoffman? No, 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 no. In Würzburg. In yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, okay. There's a lot of Hoffmans in Germany. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. But my point is, I arrived in Würzburg, what, last summer? <clears throat> and then I started the, the situation with Sky, right? Mm. Who owe me about four or five thousand. Mm. Then my SAP thing. Mm. So he started, he's had me on that mm. for since last June. Mm. And I actually said to the doctor last time, I'm like, this is ridiculous. And I'm at, get, I am at the point of I don't even want to be in Germany. Because I've done nothing. I think none of us want to be in Germany. You have to know that. No, but I don't, I don't think... Yes, yes, but you know one of the reasons I came back to you as well? Mm. I, I feel like a minority. I'm not telling you everything I have been subjected to. Yeah. I'm really not because you don't want to hear it. Okay. I have been punched, kicked, spat at. Mm. Uh, beaten by police officers. Let's put. I'll, I will tell you something now that you've made that comment. Mm. I went to Gardenham. So I'm not. I'm on. I'm supposed to be on sick. What they're coming after me is psychologically. I'm not a stupid guy. I know what they're doing. Mm. So let's say because I don't want to spend that much money. I'm in hostels. Mm. I will have someone come in and punch me in my bed. I wake up. I can't get back to sleep. Is it normal for you to go into a hostel and someone say, do you feel like a targeted individual? I'm like, who the fuck are you? I don't know you. Mm. Then I go to Gardening with one of these guys' prescriptions. I hand it over. They're like, oh, we don't have the medication right now. I'm like, mm. okay, come back at one o'clock. So I'm leaving Hanover and even my gym, which is a Spria gym, which is one of the most executive gyms in the world. Guess what they steal? My Commerce Bank credit cards and my medication. Do you know how many times that's happened in the last nine months? We're talking well over a hundred times. Mm. I've gone to the police and mm. said, this has got to stop. Mm. Do you know what the answer is? You're not German, fuck off. Mm. Sky Deutschland, I actually got a, a, this is what I'm up against. I'm not, they make you out to be like a donut, right? Mm. I've delivered $5 billion worth of ID projects and I'm dressed like a monkey. Mm. You tell me if you think this is a normal scenario. Mm. I'm in Munich. It's Arbeitsamt. They actually get some money from Sky, which not for the cheeky, but enough. The lawyer waved the money in front of me and went, he ain't getting it. I called the police side right there on Leopoldstrasse in Munich. I'm like, this is a fucking joke. He has my money. Do you know what the police I said? I said, he, I, he actually grabbed me by the arm and threw me out. I'm like, look at this. There was witnesses in the office, so his response was, he's German, he's in his office, if he wants to throw you out, he can throw you out, you're not German, I suggest you get out of Munich. Mm -hmm. I'm like, wait a minute, are you willing to go on record and say that? You are Irish, right? I'm Canadian. I'm Canadian and I have a British... Okay, I have a... A UK British. passport. A UK passport, yeah. But the point is, is that was a year ago, and they're like, get another lawyer to get... And the thing is... I should be living quite a nice lifestyle right now. I went to SAP. I have pictures, videos that forcing me to drink alcohol on site. That's one of the scenarios I got in. Mm. So then I'm taking ridiculous trains from Munich to Würzburg. I need this up I'm under massive stress. Mm. And then he's prescribing more and more massive mm. racial comments. Mm. It doesn't stop and I am going to collapse. Mm. And then I get pissed off because I come in here Mm. You were even listening to me. I spoke to a woman who couldn't understand me, sent me mm. to a psychiatrist over here. I'm like, why am I Why are you okay with a psychiatrist? Uh, well, first, you're like, you're, 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 you have a, a huge psychiatric pressure. 
Like, yes, I understand. Thirst. And that's understandable. So why am I okay with that? You really want to know? No, seriously. I mean, that's, yeah. a, that's a medical thing. Right? Yes, sir. But you know why? You were breaking the UK, right? Yes. Well, when I was in Toronto, and I'm quite a young guy, right? I worked for Bank of America, Royal Bank Canada, Bank of Montreal. I saw a psychologist because I was deemed to have stress. A psychologist is a very big difference. And yes, let me, let, me finish, let, me, let me finish. So she started prescribing, prescribing herself a phone crap. Mm. What she did was against Canadian law. She was Jewish. Okay. They brought holy hell after me. Mm. So that's one of the reasons I left Canada. So I understand psychology very, very well. Mm -hmm. And it's very, very easy to attack someone's psychology because you can't physically see it. It's a judgment, mm -hmm. right? The problem I have is mm -hmm. if you can't understand English mm -hmm. and you have no idea what I'm saying, mm -hmm. how, how do you know to send me to someone like that if you have no idea? It doesn't make any sense, no, does it? Yeah, you can't know that it doesn't make sense because, because um, there are some kind of like uh, facial features. Okay. Yeah, it, it has nothing so, to do with you. Not, not, I went to this person over here, right? You seem, like stress. you seem really stressed. You know what I mean? Would you not be if you go dealing with what I'm dealing with? You know what I'm saying? Well, I would be. That's why I'm asking why are you not okay with a psychiatrist? Because you know what I mean? That's I, all I don't trust them whatsoever. After what happened in Canada, and I went to the Ontario uh, mm. um, Board of Doctors and said this is actually against Canadian law what she did. Mm. I lost my job. I lost my home. It got ugly. That's why mm. I came here. Right? It's not appropriate to be sent to a woman over here. Mm. What the woman here said, I'm sending you to a neurologist. I said, okay, whatever. So I went over there. So she said, I'm not a neurologist. I'm like, okay, I was told that. I'm a psychiatrist. I said, I said, I specifically don't like that. Mm. And I ran this treatment before. I don't really want to talk to you. Mm. Then started making outrageous comments like, who lives with you? Where do you live? Do you live alone? Mm -hmm. I'm like, what is it? Mm -hmm. but, it's, it's, but it's not funny, it's dangerous. It's, 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 to the point, I'll be honest, I said, this is, and then I told her about the Zopacone thing. Mm -hmm. I said, if you even attempt to prescribe me any, any antipsychotic crap, mm -hmm. I'll walk out. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, my... And speaking to me got like an absolute piece of crap, mm -hmm. to the point I came out and spoke to the receptionist, and the receptionist was like, if you don't like it, get out. Mm -hmm. uh, is that a, is that yeah. a correct word to talk to someone? No, it's not. It's not. But let's take it professional. Let's talk. Let's talk about it professional. Hey, I'm a personal level. I understand your problem, and I actually I really don't think you too. No, no. Trust me, I do because I have similar problems. Every, each of us have the similar problems. Something similar, not the same, but similar. And I'm a personal level. I really have empathy for you. That's. You really should Theft, really lying, weird. stealing, I can't stop it. I, I, I can't understand, but again, let's take it professionally. Yeah. I mean, as a doctor, I can help you. I mean, I can help you in this thing with reducing your stress. Mm -hmm. Reducing your stress through medications. Sadly, I cannot help you in another way. I'm not a psychologist. I'm, I a don't, I'm glad that that's the only reason I will talk to you. If you were a psychologist, I wouldn't even talk to you. No, no. And we're not as internists. We're not allowed. Uh, last time you had a problem with the internet, like the internal medicine specialist, like an internal she medicine specialist. Hmm? She couldn't understand. She couldn't understand. understand. She had no idea about it since. As internal medicine specialist, we're not allowed to write it to the clone for long. Right. Yeah. So what I can do is give you some medications for today, not yeah. today, for the next week or two weeks. Can I tell you where I'm at? Yeah. My legal case is supposed to go ahead on November 7th, right? Mm -hmm. So it looks like I'm going to have to take mm -hmm. SAP. Mm -hmm. I'm mm -hmm. like going to have to take on SAP by myself mm -hmm. because my lawyer has disengaged. Okay. I am kidding. Me for a second, I have to ask. Do you machine mama? Do you mama? No. One tablet? One tablet? No, no, no. One 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 one, 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 one medication. So there, yeah, are two, one, the, one, the, one. there are two two medications. One of them is Topical, mm -hmm. the one that you use. Yeah, yeah. And the other one is Tabo. The what is it? The I don't know if you know it or not. It is actually for the relaxing. Yeah, I know what it is. Better. Can I tell you exactly where I'm at? Yeah. Usually I'm a very strong, healthy guy. You know, I'm quite athletic. Mm -hmm. It is getting very close to the point of I cut my losses and I go. Mm -hmm. Because I shouldn't really be on any medication, mm -hmm. but I am being subjected to a brutal harassment. Mm -hmm. 
and the thing is, is this as an example, this mm -hmm. guy has been prescribing this Ophicon for a very long time. I'm now well aware of what it is because depending on which doctor you go to, you get spoken to like an absolute, not very nicely. And I keep getting this thrown back in my face that I'm not German, I'm not German, I'm not German. I said, I am very sorry that I'm not German. You know, so you don't have to be sorry. No, but it's getting to that point. It's, 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 it's getting to that point. And the problem is, is that, is that the amount of racial assault, like I can't fight everybody. And the problem is, is let's say this doctor, I don't really specifically trust him because to go on five weeks and prescribe the amount he got, he, he's starting to think it's a big joke and it's a big game. It's my life. It's, I'm not a toy. But he's not allowed to do it. No, I know. But the problem is I'm being treated like a toy. Like mm -hmm. a toy. I'm a 40 year old man who's mm -hmm. probably even more highly educated than he is. Yeah. But the problem is I can't go to Sky Deutschland and say, give me my money. I can't go to SAP and say, give me my money. Mm -hmm. Because the whole time I've been here, and this is another thing, just on, on a basic level, mm -hmm. sleep-wise, mm -hmm. I have not I've gone from hostel to hotel, mm -hmm. to hostel to hotel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Even if I didn't, I know. that's difficult enough in itself for 14 yeah. months. You know why I'm doing that? Because I never know if I'm going to get paid, and I'm not going to get paid. Yeah. It yeah. is constant. Yeah, I'll give you something right. with the left hand, I'm going to give it back with the right hand. Yeah. So I'm constantly on yeah. edge. Um, so yeah. it's getting to the point. Yeah. Okay. I've got to cut my lot. Like either my health completely c collapses. Look at the state I arrived in when I first saw you. Mm -hmm. Either I, I figure a way to cut my losses and I go, or I'll be honest. If this continues much longer, my health will completely deteriorate, and it's. It, I mean, I'm, I feel like I'm destroying myself here right now. Mm -hmm. I I know exactly what this is. If I was treated like a normal human being since I got here, mm. I should be living a decent life. I've not been to a bar, a club, lived a normal life because mm. I am being bombarded with bullshit. Mm. Like on the Deutsche Bank, I'm not German, racist attacks, constant theft, my employer not paying me. It's non-stop. Yeah. And I literally got to the point in and I'm like, if you really don't want me to stay in Germany because I'm not German, just fucking tell me. Mm. Because even when I'm in Canada or UK or whatever, Germans might be getting racially assaulted. I'll be the first one to get, hey, you can't say that. Mm. Dude, what I have dealt with has been, I mean, excuse my language, brutal. Mm. Brutal. Mm. Mm. And I actually dress like this mm. because I refuse to buy any more clothes. Mm. I don't only have the Prada, the Gucci, the, I'm sick of the theft. Mm. I have gone to the If I can't go to the police and say, by the way, this guy just punched me or he just stole that and they won't record it, I have a big problem. Mm. And as my court case gets worse and more, closer and closer, mm. it gets worse and worse. Okay. Where I am in Dusseldorf right now, no one appears to have bothered me in my accommodation. But dude, I'm staying in a hotel. I'm not a millionaire. Mm. I can't, it's not normal accommodation. And the receptionist actually said to me, she's like, with the amount of mail and everything you're getting in your situation, like how you one, a receptionist said, How are you surviving this? And two, why don't you get an apartment? The first one, I can't really answer, I don't want to answer. The second one, if I let's say I commit to an apartment here, right? A cheap apartment, I try and and then they refuse to pay me, mm -hmm. I am totally screwed. Yeah. No, no, Whereas no, no. if I'm in temporary accommodation and it gets so bad that I have to leave, I can leave. Mm -hmm. And that I have been jumping through hoop after hoop mm. since I got here. Mm -hmm. um, as a phaser, I, I have to tell you something. Mm. I I really really would like to help you, yeah. But I at, you the, can. at, the, end, at the end of the day, I can only help you medically. Yeah. And at the end of the day, I have to check out patients. You know what I mean? I'm really sorry for saying this. The other patients. Oh yes, I know. You asked me. Really sorry. Me. I cannot. I cannot just you know. I again. Let's, 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 let's get to the point. Do you need Sophicone yes. or do you want something else? Or it's the only thing that else? helps me. No other thing that helps you. Yes, and what I will say is, is I need a permanent doctor. And Hoff is a good one. But he's not he, here. No, he, he's back. I think he's back from his vacation already. Okay. When, I, I, when I went the Monday after I spoke to you, mm. I was told he's not here for three weeks. Three weeks is not up yet. 
But when he comes back, you can talk to him and he will always prescribe you what you want. He will not allow to prescribe something long for longer. I understand that. That's Just understand the pressure I'm under. I definitely understand. It's already yes. have empathy for this because I had similar situations. But I have to tell you, at the end of the day, we're all in Germany. Yeah, for sure. Not, I'm not only not German, I'm also black here, I'm also black, uh, not black, but Dude, dark. Dude, I'm in the sun, I'm brown. <laughs> okay. I'm yeah. trying to make a joke of it, but I am... All I'm asking is to be treated like a human, that's really it. Uh, try this guy, and uh, I think he will help you a lot. I mean, hope this this uh, uh, clinic, like the private thing, cabinet. And, um, and again, he will help you for a while, but then he will say, I cannot... Yeah. Well, after November 7th, depending on what happens on that day. I don't think you're uh, by yourself, she said. What do you mean? No, that's when the court date against SAP is. Ah, okay, okay. Depending on what happens on that date, it's going to completely determine whether I stay or I don't. Oh. If I say screw me in court, I, but that's it. I've had enough. No. I wish you all the best. Thanks for listening to me. No problem, no problem, no problem. Enjoy. Your prescription, you have to print it. Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I have to go to the nurse on the phone and she'll uh, and, 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 and right. print it for you. Enjoy, huh? Have a nice life. Bye. 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 Bye.